fictional game containing sensitive subjects. It has suicide literally in the name of it, guys. Be aware. Be aware that horror games are usually the things that are going to be a little touchy. It's your boy. Uh, shitty elf. Game. Let's go! Fuck yeah! Oh, I'm excited. And crash. You're making sure I don't I mean I don't normally do spooks. We're gonna see. I have no idea what this is like. I just heard that it was really good from a friend. My Danicole! Why'd you use all Oh, I like that the subtitles are not the same thing as what's written on here. Faced with a dragon, one must brandish a sword and shield. Sometimes one has to know when to kneel before the dragon. Are you a daughter of everyone that dreams of beautiful this world? You've been through a lot, and I know things haven't always been easy, but remember what Dr. Franklin said after your speech at high school graduation. I've always thought of you as a fighter based with the toughest challenges, is capable of brandishing all the weapons necessary to fight courageously and heroically. I never talked about what happened with Leonard, your father. Leonard, your father! But now I need to tell you a few things before this illness separates us. Boy, loud. Um, I can control this. Mm, no, I don't want to go. Okay, I'll go. No, wait. Okay, let's go. Excuse me. Hey. Bump up out my fucking umbrella zone, bitch boys. I got places to be, people to see. The affair your father had with a young woman nine years ago and her suing suicide broke our family out of the park forever. I imagined exactly what was going through your head in that moment. Von, my father no longer exists for me. I can even trust my mother. Okay. That your father had irreparably, irreparably betrayed your trust, and that she had done the right thing by throwing herself off the cliff. Fuck me, man. I was there. I've always been there. When you dislocated your shoulder at the first... At the first game, when you sobbed at night in a room you didn't recognize the when his Duncan forms under the Christmas mistletoe in 1985, he emerged against abortion and into the first college year. Duncan was a good kid, but even if I've never said so before, I immediately thought you wouldn't have a lot to talk about. Talking is the foundation for every relationship. If you don't talk, you drift apart. There is so much to say when you don't. When you don't have a lot of time to say it. First of all, I'm sorry. Oh, here we go. This is gonna be a time. I heard this has one of like the best stories of a game. So we're gonna see what happens, boys. Let's let's figure it out. I've never I've never thought rage was an emotion worthy of a good Christian. It's me. But I used it. I used it to endure pain. I don't want you to live your life like I have, my love. I want you to face... I want you to be free from the past, once and for all. That is why I want to do exactly as I say. Sell our hotel. The hotel is my family's, and you're entitled to it. Go back there, Nicole. I have hired a lawyer in Helena. Mr. Jenkins, uh, to give you this letter, uh, Mr. Jenkins, to give you this letter once your father has passed away. I will already be long, gone long. Take a quick inspection, sign the papers, and sell those, sell those balls that hold nothing but rage. Keep what you need to pay off your university loans and give the rest to the girl's family. Let's end this story once and for all. Always been there for each other. I wish I could still be there at your graduation, your wedding, my grandchildren's birth. That's it. We don't know how much time we have. Oh, it's got like little tear splotches on it. Oh, it's got tear splotches! 
use yours to love. There's nothing else worth fighting for. Fighting for... Fighting for... Or dying for, believe me. I love you above all else. Forgive me for being, like, unable to read your mother. Thanks, Mom. Oh, let's go visit Mom. Uh, yeah, hi. The fuck up out my way. That's a fancy fucking coffin. Goddamn. That's nice. I'm gonna get a PB sandwich. I don't know what's happened. We read a letter. That was it. We the bad weather across letter. Montana is amassing all the characteristics of an atypical storm. The bad turn is proving worse than expected, with above average winds and snowfall, especially <laughs> forecast for Helena National Forest Natural Reserve. The National Weather Service warns residents to follow all instructions given by local authorities so and to we're avoid get all unnecessary travel. A big bad Some concerned storm meteorologists stuck, are comparing it to the hotel. storm that hit Billings in 1955, with 42 inches of snow falling over a single night. Are we heading into the mother of all winners in Lewis and Clout County? Shit. Snowstorm, you're about to get kidnapped by a ghost? Uh -uh. Hello from Montana. So is this shining? It might be, hell. I have no idea what to expect from this game. I literally have no clue. But it is really pretty. This is a really pretty game so far. Nix, if this ends up being really good, will you uh, kick my ass into downloading it and getting it like edited or at least smell. getting it to you to edit? That's all I remember from the night we departed ten years ago. That smell. My car! It smells like my car. Wow, these are sounds alright and a very weird tracking system for the mouse. Maybe I can up my sensitivity a bit. Yeah, there we go. Oh, this sounds awful. Garage door, button, up button, E. Oh, what, what? Oh, space zooms in. Let's see what this so-called button does. All right. I hate the sounds in here, so I'm gonna leave now. Oh, it's just the wind being fucky. Okay, toolbox, observe, oh, okay. So is that that? Ah, oh, that's my father's motorbike. I call him Leonard, because I hate him. Okay, cool. Ah, uh, this is really pretty. Welcome, check-in reception, hall and locker room. Oh, it's just clicks. Okay, I don't have to like drag everything around like I did in the other game. What was that behind us? That's for Yuge. The attorney said to check the office first. It should be just beyond the mountain museum at the end of the stairs to the main floor, if I remember right. I don't even know what you said. I'm surprised you can remember all that shit. That gave me an option for a second to do something, but I lost it. Oh shit. So I'm gonna get that. And this place. This place has like the works of places that would be spooky. Ah, the museum! Oh, hell yeah, dude. Look at that. That's nice. Okay, you know I hate the sounds of cell phones. This game knew that I hated the sound of er, well, cell phones. Phones ringing. Kill me. Where? Am I blind? It's in here. Thank you for calling. Please leave a message. Yeah, asshole. Leave a message. It's a wild ass zoom. Voicemail, please. 911 emergency. How can I help you? What's your emergency? Hello? Can you hear me? Uh, What's your emergency? Okay. Mr. McGrath, hi, it's Paulie from Century Telephone Company. Okay. I'm sorry to bother you. 
But as I told you last time, the company requires cutting off the telephone service to delinquent customers. I... I'm really sorry, Leonard, but my hands are tied. We have to go ahead. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Yeah, fuck you, Leonard. Idiot. Uh, yeah, Nicole, it's Jenkins, the attorney. The hotel chain that wants to take over your hotel has just dumped a mammoth holy bible of documents on my desk that I need to check through. I have to personally go to the county land registry office before we meet. Listen, I know Says you Dad's office. Want to Wait, what? To father's funeral, but now the hotel is entirely your property. The law requires you to assess its condition before putting it well, on it does. the market. Uh, it's uh very noble of your mother to want to repay that poor girl's family, Rachel. Not everyone would deprive themselves of such a sum. Anyway, it's up to you now. Get to it. I'll bring you a burger you Portland folks can only dream of. Okay. Oh, yeah. I left you some notes and a master key on the dining room table of your family's old apartment. Start your rounds from there. Give me a couple of hours. Don't run off. All right. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Am opens a map. That's a map, all right. Um, I, I should have am. hired a decent attorney from Portland, Mom, not this potato head. Come on, let's do this. Cool. So we have things to do. E shows the next floor. What? Oh man, that's a lot going on. Oh boy, there's a lot of there's a lot of floors. Okay. Wow. Okay, there's a main floor, a basement, a second floor, a first floor. Gotcha, so we have a floor zero through two. Holy shit. I'm gonna go get stuck in the fridge, I guess. I cannot take the right for the ha -ha. So we come out here. So this is offices, right? Right? Hear me out. We take this left. Take this left. Can't go that way. Take this left. I keep wandering until I fucking find doors that are already open. That lead me to the dining hall. There we go. Ah, uh, yes. I would like to enter the dining hall, please. Uh, we got stairwell here that goes up all the way. And it's not that double stairwell. Fuck, there's a lot of stairwells here. Give me a fucking second, boys. I don't know where. There I am. You are here. We did it. It is the double stairwell. We did it, boys. We're right in the fucking middle. Thank you, map on the wall. You really are what I needed here. Okay, Master Sweet. Let's go. Master Sweet. Music World. Play hard, stay rock. Play rock, stay hard. Play, stay hard, rock. Rock, stay hard, play. All right. What's up, fuckers? Wow, this is... That's a lot of books, buddy. Is this my old room? Hell yeah, dude. Oh, I had fucking taste. All right, there's Jenkins' letter. Jenkins, Jenkins, give me the fucking letter. Uh, hey, dear me. This is uh to inform you that nominated personal resident Ben Fair Wilson is needed to transfer. Blah 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 blah. Uh, if you're not object, blah 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 blah. Cool, whatever. Last will and testament. Cool. See you later, nerd. Where's the uh? Where's the shit you want me to have? Probably not this here box. What the fuck? Light bulb flux. Exposure time. Like, this is a science book filled with science. What was I supposed to do with that? A pen. Army of box. This baby can hold so many books. Oh, a camera? A Polaroid? Hell yeah, dude. Who would who would do this? This is a fire hazard. That's a fire hazard, dog. 
I know a thing or two about fire hazards, and that's one of them. God, everything's here exactly the same as when me and Mom left ten years ago. How are you, old friend? It's so... Doesn't matter. Quick tour, nothing more, Nicole. Oh, my uncompleted 360 flip. Victims in the last three days... Every time I turn on a radio, it's sad shit. I literally have... Look at all these. Look at all these tracks I could be playing. But no. Every time I fucking want to turn on, like, music. I hate it. I hate it. Why does every game do that? Oh, there's some keys. Management keys, please. Are you done? Because I would love to listen to my, like, jams, dog. VHS. Oops. Uh, management key, please. This is the manager's key my mom wouldn't give me when I was little. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. I'll need a master key for the guest rooms, though. What's that, a floppy disk? Yeah, right. <laughs> strange telephone? It does appear strange. Uh, what was I up here to do again? Oh, nothing. Cool, I got the... I got it. I got what I needed. Great. Well, about time I hit the old dusty trail. Strange phone? Ah, I knew. I knew it would be. What is Hello, this strange joke? phone? Yellow. Hello? Yeah. C can you hear me? Is this Miss McGrath? Wilson. McGrath was my father's. Uh, uh, this is um, uh, Helena Federal Emergency Management Agency. Uh, my name is uh, Irving Crawford. Irving, I'm gonna need you to fucking uh, Mr. Jenkins get your shit together. Arriving. Uh, Mr. Jenkins is a very enterprising man. Oh, uh, I, I guess so. I, I, I wouldn't know. I'm kidding. Oh, uh, right. Any reason for your call, Irving, from Federal... What you call it? I'm calling to assist you during your stay at the hotel. What? Uh, the Timberline is old but sturdy. You'll enjoy your stay and be safe, no problem. Uh, the furnace, wiring, it's all under control. Oh, okay, enough. What? I don't know what Jenkins told you, but I have zero intention of staying here longer than, let's say, 20 minutes. Oh. But, but the storm. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I'm leaving straight away. <laughs> Maybe you're not aware. Thanks for everything. Irving, right? Irving. Yeah. I... You... I... Bye. Man, you are just a salty... A salty sour puss. He's just trying to help. Never thought to find anything like that. Montana. It's in here. Oh, look at this bathroom. Man, this is a pretty game. I wasn't aware it was be like... I've had this game for a hot minute. I wasn't aware that it was going to be like a very pretty game. Unless someone's walking up here to kill me, I ain't running. Unless someone's coming at me with a murdering, I ain't running. No. I want to see how we die first. Still there, Irving? Huh? Oh yeah, uh, I'm still here, Miss McGrath. I, I mean, Miss Wilson. When you said this shack was sturdy. Oh, that's what I was trying to tell you before. Uh, around these parts, the weather. How much time do I have to move? Ah, uh, uh, the snow piles up pretty quick, and uh, uh, some parts over 3,000 feet are already icing over. I gotta risk it. Uh, you're not thinking of taking the car. I mean, obviously I am. 
I don't know how to say what I want to say. There's no way to change. Uh, yeah. I guess I need to use the wheel. Uh, uh, listen, if your car uh, breaks down, we can't come get you. Not even with tanks. Whatever happened to Miss Wilson? Uh, oh, uh, sorry about that. I, I just... Uh... Nicole is fine. That said, thanks for everything. Again. Thanks. Uh, seriously, if you ended up out there with your car gone dead, with 12 inches of snow and 20 degrees below zero, your lungs would collapse in a few minutes. I remember how things work in the mountains. Luck doesn't exist. As a, a FEMA agent, I have to insist... You know, you're not the first man... To, to do what? To try and stop me. Hey, uh, wait! Bye! You're really gonna have to calm down with that nonsense. What can go dog. wrong? I have a 1986 Dodge. Oh, and you're right, you're right. I'm just kind of, like, randomly wandering, too. Like, no real rhyme or reason. This is pretty. I wonder what is, uh, what was supposed to go here. I won't stay here a minute more. No way. The attorney, he'll take care of everything. Fuck all this. Oh. The dining hall? Oh, that's cool. Well! Gonna head back toward, towards the car. Gotta head back towards my car. Got a 1986 Dodge. I drive a Dodge Stratus. I'm important. I am extremely important. I'll get in my car in a second. I gotta go open the doors first. Skiddly doo, open the door. Oh, I guess I'm gonna get in my car first, then open the door somehow. I drive a Dodge Stratus. Tell me you changed your mind. You there? Uh-huh. Uh, oh, yeah, right. Uh, it's a direct line. I can't find my car keys. My fucking car keys. I left them on the seat. Are you sure? Think so. Maybe someone... <sighs> uh, no. Listen. This office is about 12 miles from the hotel as the crow flies. It's 40 miles by road. There's nothing or no one in between, and that's not a good thing right now. God damn it. I knew it. Uh, oh, maybe the keys are in your pocket. Wow, that didn't even cross my mind. Hey, you never know sometimes. Only I've asked someone on the phone yeah, where my phone was. was I was cheap. looking for my phone. No problem. Uh, the keys will turn up. Uh, the good news is that we have these new cell phones. Uh, that's what they call them. Uh, radio doesn't reach out there. I bypass the signal to create a direct line through a shortwave sequence. Cell phones. It's like a two-way radio station that's always open. <sighs> this place. I vowed to never come back. Listen, That's right, it said strange phone. I might I like only that. be a voice, but remember I'm here for you. If you need me, just call. Seriously. Ugh. Fine. Wow, fuck this. Now I guess I gotta get used to being here. this way. Danger boiler room. <laughs> I sense no danger here. It's a hydraulic pump. Just gonna slap some of these buttons around. I live in a place where people leave their car, <laughs> their cars unlocked, so if it gets broken into, you don't have to pay for broken windows. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good move. Let me take our keys. Yeah, you never leave your keys. You just don't leave anything of value in your vehicle. That's that. That's just the end of the game, bud. See, Ben is always on toilet duty. Sucks to suck, Ben. So what's the deal here? Like, I'm just trying to kind of explore. This place is massive. There's a basement that I definitely don't want to go into. Fuck that. Oh man, 
Wait, where am I? I feel like I have made a series of mistakes just getting myself to where I am. Ski route. That shit is locked. The ski route is not the place to be. It is too damn cold outside. Let me see if I can see the ski route on this bad boy. Uh, basement. I am not in this part of the basement. Garage, boiler room. Ski room was that in the top right, I think. I think top right is, is that. So this goes towards the church. Well, now I gotta go back to the, apparently that. Does this lead towards the church? No? That's weird. I don't know what leads towards the church. But this puts me back near the boiler room and into the basement basement. Oh, that's probably the path to the fucking spooky church. Because there's laundry. Yeah, there's laundry. Here's boiler room. It's fucked up. Jar of beans! Whose jar of beans is this? Alright, boiler room. Let's go back to the garage. And try to open the garage door for some reason. I hope it still works. Why? Why would you open the garage door? Why would you open the garage door in this scenario? I don't understand why that would be an option. A button! I can't open the garage door. It's a conspiracy, damn it. Uh, stuff freezes up with the cold. I have to get out of here. I'm not sure you get it. Look. I left this place ten years ago. I had no idea I would have to come back here, let alone stay a night. Nicole, I know your story. Everyone in the valley knows it. Your father, Rachel. That name. I haven't heard that name since I left. I didn't want to be out of line. Don't mention the past. Okay. This is an interesting sitch. Shit, locked. I guess it's time to just get a snack and like relax, right? This is a relaxing game of eating snacks. I'll tell you what. Okay. It's pretty hey, good. uh, found anything useful? No. No keys. No garage door. I can't get out of here without freezing. Christ. It's probably game room. only for a night. Uh, the conditions might get better tomorrow. They might? Uh, look, I'll be on duty all day. Call me when you want. Even just to talk. Okay. Oh, thanks, Irving. Just doing my job. Nicole? Yeah. I if I may. What? I'd like to give you some advice. If it comes with the job... You're safe up there. Just relax. It'll be fine. That uh, okay. somehow makes me feel uh, less later. safe. Why does that make me feel a lot less safe I than I currently it. am? I'm stuck. Shit. I feel significantly less safe. Day, day one! Oh no! Day one implies there's gonna be many more days!